Hello, I'm Dr. David Anderson with the Large Animal Hospital at the Veterinary Medical Center here at the University of Tennessee. And today I'm visiting with Dr. Dan Ward. And Dr. Ward is a specialist in ophthalmology. And so that means he's an expert of diseases of the eye. And today we're specifically talking about diseases of horses. And so what types of uh, problems would horses have that they would need an ophthalmologist? That's a good question. Um, variety of things. Most of the eye diseases that we see in horses are uh, what we term anterior segment or front of the eye diseases, eyelid diseases, corneal diseases, conjunctiva. Um, uh, this guy's an example. Uh, Roscoe had a, a type of cancer on the outside of that left eye called squamous cell carcinoma. And we were able to do a, a combination surgical procedure and application of radiation therapy to reduce the chance that it would, uh, that it would recur. So it's a fairly, fairly common procedure here at the university. So that sounds like something that requires very specialized facilities and expertise. And so we would sort of act as an extension of the veterinarian's practice by providing that? Absolutely, absolutely. If you know, the, the referring veterinarian on the front end had not recognized this problem, we would never even be seeing Roscoe. Uh, and uh, by the same token, once Roscoe goes home, it's going to be strictly important that the referring veterinarian do aftercare uh, to make sure that this thing heals properly and to, to watch for recurrence. That's a, a really critically important part of the team. Yeah, and so that's what we're about here at the University of Tennessee is supporting that team between the owner, the referring veterinarian, and experts like Dr. Ward here in this tremendous facility. If we can do anything for you, if you need assistance with the health care of your horses, we're here to assist you in any way we can. We'd love to see you in Knoxville sometime soon.